I'm going to take you on a day with me and what better way of starting today than picking fresh fruits from the garden before i went out to pick the fruits gabriel was making breakfast and while i was in the garden picking some blackberries the good thing about this blackberries is that they are all over the place when it's their season and they are free to pluck because they are literally everywhere in the garden when you're walking in the woods if you go for a walk you see fresh free blackberries and i like get it, picking them up washing them and i eat them different way i can add them to my cereal i can add them to my yogurt i can blend them i can have them as smoothie filter out the seed of course but it's always good to have a healthy nice breakfast with some blackberries after that i went out for a walk because i was going out of town to a different city so i decided to go for a walk while gabriel is still making his breakfast what he was making is pumpkin i've never seen pumpkin with seasoned with cinnamon and herbs but what can we do we are in an interracial marriage and also having interracial food <laughs> so we get to eat everything anyways i back to my blackberries there's this place where there are loads of blackberries that you can Block. you see all those empty places that the blackberries were it's all me i've picked all of them so i like just picking them having them at home or just fruit freeze them and it's always good you can have these blackberries with your smoothie you can have them with your uh, oats porridge it's very good when you have them with porridge or cereal and blackberries have, are very healthy they are good antioxidants they are good for the heart they help boost the immune system and they regulate your blood level and they are quite very good blackberries are one of the super food and to think that you can see them for free it's very good i always take the opportunity when it's blackberry seasons to pick a lot of them because if you're going to buy them you get them from the shop for very expensive prices however you can just easily pick them up from the woods for free oh look at them blackberries anyways today i'm planning on visiting my friends so later i'll be taking you on a trip through the train station and something about the blackberries to note is when you're picking them try to press them the soft one some of them has like um insects living inside it so always check that it is not too soft try to press them check that the ones you're picking are the hard ones otherwise you might pick some that has some things living in them look at those blackberries aren't they lovely anyways i'm going out on my trip stay with me while going for this walk because i will also be explaining to you the reason why blackberry is classified as superfood so the next time you're going on the road and you see blackberries lying there in the woods you would be eager to pick some some of the reasons are blackberries are rich in pro protective plant compounds and they may also protect against heart diseases because they relax your blood vessel they may support cardiovascular health because they are very rich in vitamin c and potassium Blackberries is one of the fruits that also help prevent cancer. Blackberries boost the brain power. Blackberries are also have blackberries also have anti-inflammatory effects and they support you if you have like arthritis. They also support your oral health and also have antiviral effects. Blackberries have anti-diabetic effects. So if you have diabetes or you're pre-diabetic and you're battling it, you may want to consider including loads of blackberries in your diet. Blackberries also support the gut and they help treat cold sore. They are also one of the fruits that help support and boost the immune system. This is me on the street. I was going to see my friend and I saw this museum in St. News. I'll be making a detailed video about the St. News Museum in my next video. But 
right now we went to with my friend we went into this St. News Museum to just have a look around and I was amazed at the lot of details I saw in this museum don't worry I made a video of the museum and I'll be posting it next in this channel so this museum is one of the oldest museum and why it is notable is because this museum was once a courthouse and a prison so the top floor of this museum was once a courthouse where they judge people why the first floor was once a prison so it's quite handy <laughs> Because once you come to the courthouse and you've judged, they've judged your case and sentenced you to prison, you don't need to travel to the prison. You just walk downstairs and a cell will be readily available for your use. This was when the lady showed me the toilet of the museum. And the good thing about this museum is that the wet flush is outside. Oh, look at that beautiful, lovely weather. I'm back from my walk now and I'm going back. I decided to take the train station. So that's the view of the train station while I'm going back. And I also came cycling. So that's my bicycle while at this train station. And I like the way you can take the the bicycle with you on the train is quite good it's quite good <coughs> and that's me at the train station waiting for the train and sometimes when you wait for the this platform is quite tricky because 